Hey, what's up everybody? It's Neil here. Today I'm going to show you how to get a floating window with the lyrics of the current track that is playing on your device. Now it's pretty straightforward and simple. You need one application called Floating Lyrics, available free on Google Play. Now once you actually install this free application, you're going to want to go to your security settings. So go to settings, go to more, go to security and go down to notification access and just grant it access from there. Now this will make it work with Spotify. Next, you're going to want to open the application itself and this will actually enable it or you can just hit the check up there. So Floating Lyrics now enabled. You can opt to save lyrics to external storage. You can change the font that's within inside the uh, floating window and you can prevent screen timeouts this is why another reason why you need to give it uh, notification access then there's also autocorrect track name you can do some search engine tweaks remove text between brackets um, or parentheses if a song has a parentheses featuring so and so or whatever you can also allow it to remove unnecessary characters and then you can also let it remove numbers. Say you uploaded it and all the tracks have a number before them, like one, two, three. Sometimes that happens. So this helps you clean it up depending on how you uploaded it onto your device. You can select languages. If you're listening to some Spanish songs, you can check Spanish, Indian, a bunch of languages there. So once it's enabled, just open up a music player. It works well with the stock music player for Samsung, and it also works well with the Google music player as well. But we're just gonna open up the Samsung music player. All right, so just put a song on, and your window should pop up. There you go. You can actually tap on it to remove that, um, that ad. So, I mean, you can resize it, you can make it full screen, oops, you can actually minimize it, like I just accidentally did, and then you can just bring it back up for me notification. But, um, you can make it full screen, and you can go home and do your stuff still. You can also browse the web with it, basically use it anywhere, even a game, I was playing Temple Run, and I still had it open. You do have to scroll and keep up with the lyrics, which is right now my only complaint with it. I wish that it would go along with the song, but it's not that big of a deal. Um, so yeah, move it around wherever it's convenient and just get the lyrics because it makes singing along a lot easier and you also get to interpret the song in your own way or however the artist intended. But like I said, it works well with um, Google, Google Play Music, it works well with the stock music app on Samsung, and it also works with Spotify pretty well. Just make sure to grant it notification access. So definitely check out the full guide. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe for more useful videos, and thanks for watching.